Web Expo 2024, Building Resilient Entrepreneurs, is the crowning event of the marketing access support that SIA beneficiaries have been receiving. It reflects the commitment that the Rural Development Unit has demonstrated towards fulfilling its goal of building resilience among rural communities by fostering sustainable development. This event was designed to showcase the success of our beneficiaries in their pursuit of creating quality output for their clients. The Climate Smart Agriculture and Rural Enterprise Program, SIA, hosted an exposition showcasing the products and services offered by our beneficiaries. The exposition was under the theme, SIAP Expo 2024, Building Resilient Entrepreneurs, and was held at the Seaton James Street in Grenville, St. Andrew, on Friday, March 1st, 2024. Let me give special recognition to the exhibitors. Today is your day. Today was designed to demonstrate the products that you have so skillfully and so nicely developed over the last two years in particular. We want to recognize you here and certainly the staff of SIAP, especially the steering committee that has led this effort in a very short space of time. Um, the results are here and I'm very, very impressed. I consider the display that I see here as perhaps one of the best examples of what it is for our country to be economically independent, where our people can make use of our resources, having received the kind of training and knowledge and exposure and the kind of empowerment that they need, be creative and be innovative and produce goods final goods that are attractive, that are healthy, and that can be sold anywhere in the world. That to me is a demonstration of our economic independence. We are in a position where we are not just able to feed ourselves from the goods that we produce from our raw materials, but we are also producing at a level that we have enough to satisfy domestic production and also to have enough for exports. The main objectives were to promote the products, produce and services of the SIA beneficiaries, to provide awareness of the SIA program and to showcase the successes of the Rural Development Unit, to build the beneficiaries' brand image, to provide an opportunity to expand the market of the beneficiaries, a wide variety of products ranging from skincare, jewelry, manufacturing, teas, pepper sauce, tamarind sauces, cakes, pastries, bags, cornfish, coconut oil, cocoa balls, arts and craft, health and wellness, photography, beauty, skincare products, and hydroponics. Over 35 boots were exhibited at the Saeb Expo. Five 4-H clubs were invited to attend the session and participated in games and CSA demonstrations. They were also able to sample the nutritious, tasty dishes prepared by the Grenada Food and Nutrition Council. My name is Stephanie Morin from the Grenada Food and Nutrition Council. Today we showcased some of um, our items there. We had breadfruit skin. We made breadfruit fries with the skin, so we show persons how they can visualize the breadfruit skin to make fries and so because usually that's what we throw away. We also had things like our blogger tostones, um, breadfruit tostones, and on our ways that you can use breadfruit to make different snacks for your kids at school and so forth. Other institutions such as Creative Development Bank, Grenada Cooperative Network Association, Grenville Cooperative Credit Union Limited, Communal Cooperative Credit Union Limited, and Ease Paralegal Services were also given the opportunity to showcase some of the products they are currently offering to the public. Let's hear from the beneficiary's perspective. My name is Shami Spice, the owner of the Face Shami Spice Collection. 
And today I'm at the Expo and actually I had some nice, beautiful glam dolls today, which I had for my models. I'm excited to uh, be a part of this Expo because it's an exposure for my business and I would like people to get to know, to know more about myself. So this is a great experience. Well, my name is Basta Mitchell and I am the marketing officer of the Grenada Cooperative Nutmeg Association. And we are here today at the SIEP Building Resilience Entrepreneur Expo and we are displaying some of our nutmeg produced products. We have the products are made from nutmeg and it's byproduct. My name is Samuel Alexander and I am the owner and operator of a business called an agro-processing business called Ignite Flavors. We are interested in un untapping the potential of Grenada. So we look at abundant fruits, vegetables, seasonings on the island and we create high quality food products. So our foundation sauces that we currently have are tamarind sauce and mango sauce. Hello, I'm Tamika Gilbert and I'm the creative mind behind Mika Naturals. I'm a body butter manufacturer and I'm here at the SIEP Expo 2024. Right there in front, let's present out of Maribo. I'm originally from Sista Isle, Caracu. Uh, my products are, I may manufacture local cocoa, so I do the local cocoa balls and cocoa products. So I have the local ponche cream done with local cocoa. You have the cocoa syrup. Then I have snacks made from cocoa. There is a local cocoa cake and then the coconut oil. So today we actually have on display, we are depicting some of the interventions that the CSA Extension Division would have implemented for many of the farmers in Grenada and Karaku. So if we look closely, we have here uh, integrated pest management system. And this here is the use of using color traps as a method for pest control. Right? It's a natural means and it's a sustainable practice. It's, a, it's basically to use without the use of artificial or chemical pesticides. So we use a natural means here by using the sticky traps. And then based on the color of the traps, it will attract different types of, of pests. Then again here, we have here showing you the different type of conservation methods that could be used. So today's expo was showcase a wide array of not just products, but services that the SIA program was able to implement over the six year period. I trust that this is something that many of the participants who showed me, who came up today, that they were able to get a good idea as to what SIA was about and um, they appreciate the interventions we would have made with the program to impact on the lives of persons in the rural communities. A total of 3,860 persons have been impacted by the SIEP program thus far. SIEP Expo 2024 was predominantly a marketing initiative. SIEP Expo 2024, Building Resilient Entrepreneurs, was the crowning event of the marketing access support that SIEP beneficiaries have been receiving. It reflects the commitment that the Rural Development Unit has demonstrated towards fulfilling its goal of building resilience among rural communities by fostering sustainable development. This event was designed to showcase the success of our beneficiaries in their pursuit of creating quality output for their clients. We thank all who made this event a success.